this one video i don't know whether it's going to be a long video or a short video but then this is going to be an interesting video thank you so much for being in this making this video topic a part of your day we are going to dive down into 10 step process of writing your email 10 step process of writing your email sequences now in email sequences is this is specifically for your audience this is specifically for your audience. I just have to say whether it's for audience and members both because audience is the people who haven't paid you money. Members are the people who have paid you money. So we are not talking about the members. Though you can use the principles over here as well, but then we are just talking about the audience. Like when you write an email for an cold, warm and hot audience, what is the process that I follow that it will, it can, can be helpful for you? Step number one is we are going to use like two to two, one, two, three. We are, this one video involves three platforms that you need to use. One is YouTube, you need to be having videos. Second is you need to be having a Google document. Third, you need to be having ConvertKit in that order. ConvertKit is like an app that, that the, the software that we use, the platform that we use for email marketing in the Academy of Partners. That is one of the greatest ones that I have come across. That is on longer run and towards the end of it. You don't have to just go ahead and invest that. Go with the flow and see when that comes in. Okay. Step number one is have a ready framework when you write an email you need to know okay what has to be mail one what has to be mail two what has to be mail three what has to be mail six what has to be mail ten you need to have a framework ready so in other video that we discussed is what do you have to send to cold audience warm audience and hot audience we have done a session on we have done a videos on that with that one you can search on google uh, you can search on the keyword research in this let me find it for you Let me find it for you. So if you see, let me put cool. Four cool ways to prove audience like cooler. Four set secrets to nurture your cold audience. So in this one video, you will get to know okay, what what has how do you have to be talking about that? So in this one video, in that video is talking about the framework of it. So once you have the framework ready with you, then what do you have to do next? Framework makes things easier for you. If I say, okay, I am dash in my evening, you have to fill like what I what I had dash in the evening, I had sleep in the evening, I had food in the evening, I had dinner in the evening, whatever that is. So when you when someone gives you a free work, it becomes easier for you to fill in the blanks. In that one, in that one video, you have, have spoken about the framework of it. Ha having a framework makes life so much more easier. Step number two. The step number two process of writing an email is like list down the sequence of priority videos. Step number two is priority videos. Now, when you have content already created on YouTube videos, we have spoken that about in different videos. But then when you have assets created on your YouTube channel and assets created in your podcast channel. What happens is you just don't have like one video. You don't have like two videos. You've got more than 50, 60 videos sitting. Nobody has watched it. Nobody has seen that video. There are no comments there are no subscribers. That's completely cool. We are not focused about that thing. You have created assets, which we are going to use over a period of time through automations, through organic, inorganic traffic. That, that's a different topic altogether. But then step number two is like, when you have already created videos, now you put them in order. Say, cold audience, what do they have to consume first? For example, if you are into if you are into workout, if you are into HIT, okay. I you your webinar talks about what are the benefits of HIT workout. Like three secrets you should be doing HIT workout on a daily basis, otherwise you'll die. Something, like that. something on those lines. It was very harsh. Something on those lines. Okay. If I want to learn three secrets of HID to do on a daily basis, being an introvert entrepreneur, like why I have to be doing it, I have to learn that. Okay, I have registered for it of your master class. Until I come and see you live that day, what are the things that I should be doing beforehand? Think about it. What are the things that I should be doing before even coming and meeting you live on that class? What are the things that a person has to be aware of? A person has to know about it. Puzzle probably is not aware of those. What are the potential things I might not be aware of? Those are all your pieces of content. Put those pieces of content, put those pieces of assets on your YouTube channel and then list them down on a priority basis. Listing down the priority basis. Step number three. 
open your google documents like go to google drive open your google document make a folder called email sequences make a folder inside that called cold warm and hot categorize them into three categories like cold warm and hot three different list three different groups three different list all together once you do that go to email go to email sequences cold cold audience click that open and open a google document now <clears throat> open like 20 google documents here for like 20 mails are going to say mail 1 on day 0 welcome day mail 2 day 0 introduction day mail 3 day 0 oh, what do you have to be doing next day mail 4 day 1 youtube video day 5 day 1 youtube video So you list on the framework I have already discussed in that. Like since I've been working on this one as well, so that's kind of really great. So in other video, the step number four talks about writer mails. Step number four literally talks about writer mail, which I actually recorded a video before this one. Four step email structure of your email of your audience email sequence. You can go ahead and watch that. Uh, uh, the structure that we spoke about is like having a high 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 hello casual opening of a mail. Uh, what inspired you to create a specific video? Having a call to action. And close the mail with the next logical steps that people have to consume. Like people have to click. It can be to a Facebook group, to a crash course that you've created, to a to a YouTube channel that you've created, to a podcast channel you've created. It can be anything. Just restrict it to three to four emails. Okay. Step number four was that. But step number five is once you write a mail. Okay. There's a we follow the four step process. You write a mail. Once you write a mail, your mail is empty. What do you mean by that? Your mail doesn't have links to it. Your mail, though your mail talks about okay, click here to do something, but that click here is still empty. You have to put the link over here. Also, you don't have any emojis around. The, this is quite tactical video, and it might go over your head if you're not actually practicing it. Because these steps are something that you need to doing as you speak, writing and doing it. This is not this this is not a video for you. You're just learning here. This, Learning and doing sort of a thing. So I'm going to give you a very strategically well to watch this one. You can get a lot of the the kind of part. And this is step number five. Talks about since your mail is purely ba- purely based on wordings, you don't have anything. Step number five is add emojis like Google emoji emoji pedia or something. Emoji pedia dot org. emojipedia.org so this is one website that we use that i use where you can just go ahead and copy the emojis like cool faces like that the mails that i that you see that you receive from me all from that platform so you can copy those emojis and place emojis wherever required not you just don't flood the mail with emojis but wherever you feel is an important and it's like this is where the emoji has to be the front sentence sometimes the call to action sometimes sometimes to the end sometimes the first thing of the subject line Put the emojis. You fill the now your mail starts looking colorful. Step number six is then again sit with the mail and since you have already done it for the first time, now when you say it for the second time, you might see a lot of things you might need to tweak. You might see a lot of things you might need to remove. You might see a lot of things that you might need to add. You might see a lot of things which is relevant. You have to remove. So you refine the mail. Step number six is refining the mail. Step number seven. Is now that the mail is refined. Now is the time you go to Reserve Pay, get the link. You go to Facebook, get the link. You go to you go to Zoom, get the link. Get all the links and start links and adding links to the places of to the places where you have let okay to link to be added, link to be added, link to be added. I do this all the time. This is something that I I personally I was doing like an hour back for cold hot or one or cold warm and hot or it's all three. I was adding this webinar Zoom webinar links like right to me. Right now, like an hour back. Step number six is like you fill in the links where the links were not there. Step number eight. Now your emails are ready. It's like the content is ready, the write-up is ready, the images are ready, the links are ready. Now it's like it's now it's it's ready to publish. What is missing? How do you publish them? They are sitting on Google Doc. You have to copy all of that. Now getting into tool. Now getting into the platform is making more sense to me here, right? So now you get into ConvertKit. Hmm. Shafuzan.co forward slash ConvertKit. There's a link down below. Click that. You click that, and you go into ConvertKit. And what do you do? You you make three different lists. We're not going to talk about that. And cold, warm, and hot, and start adding mails 
in sequences as we have already created in the Google Documents. We don't change the sequence, we don't change the ordering, we just copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste. Step number nine is when you load the whole thing in the convert kit, the formatting is different. You have to spend like an hour or two, maybe a day or two on adjusting the format that you that was already created in Google Documents. This is different format. You just have to sit, tweak and adjust. Step number nine talks about tweaking and adjusting. What do you feel is right? What do you, what do you want feel is right? Like wordings, content-wise, everything is perfect. Formatting has to be checked. Once the formatting has to be checked, step number 10 talks about publish. You hit the publish and then what do you do after publishing? A different video altogether. But then once, let me say, once once you do publishing and then once your funnel is ready, when the courses are ready, your mails are ready, this is an important part of the whole puzzle. This is all ready. You start running investments then or get into people, start, start sharing those funnels to people then so that the moment you share the funnel with the people, the mails has to be starting to go on. When the mail starts to go on, that's where you're going to get the maximum benefit of you either going organic or in order. That brings us to the conclusion of this video. Just to give a recap, step number one, ready framework you need to be having. Step number two, priority views. Step number three, open a Google Docs. Step number four, write a mail. Step number five, add emojis, define, define the mail, add links, copy paste, convert, get tweak and adjust the format. Step number 10 talks about publishing. Step number 11, the bonus step is start doing those cool things. Thank you so much for making this one video a part of your day. I'm going to see you in another exciting. I thought this video was going to be a longer one, but then thankfully, gratefully, it went all the way to 11.37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Thank you so much. I'm going to see you in another video. تبخ ترتر الجلب صوت و...